I'm not feeling the laziness right now. You know, that uh, 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 that's kind of fucked up to be Resident Evil. I mean, this is like supposed to be the shit. I know. So far, as far as the story, I'm kind of. I mean, maybe I gotta play through all the all the different story, but I'm not feeling a story right now. It's not telling me anything. It's just okay. Go here. Track Ada. Go here. Stop. You know, Boss, kill the virus and shit. You know. That's our job. You and I have a mission to complete. Got it? Yeah, I got it. Maybe we can blow it open. But um, you know, it's just. To me, five. E even though a lot of people didn't like it, it had more of a coherent story. It was a purpose. It, s it seems like with this, maybe I haven't played the other campaign, so I don't know. But making you play th four different campaigns to get the overall gist of the story is wrong. I mean, it ain't, it ain't, it ain't right or wrong, but it's fucked up. Hey, Captain, I think I found just the thing to blast that bulkhead open. I mean, because it's like you want the player to sit down and just play the game. And have a coherent experience. And right now, the way they broke up the story doesn't feel like it has a coherent story. It's like one of those stories where you appreciate the story once you read everything. And you shouldn't have to do that. You know what I'm saying? If you wanted to make different stories... Damn, that guy went down quick. If you... Oh. If you, if you want different stories, you know, in the game... Hold on. Damn, you eat all them damn shots? Just wasting my ammo on your ass. But if you, I mean, the way they should have did it was made made Chris's story a complete story. You know what I'm saying? From A to B, whatever it is. Then made Leon's something different. But let's say at the end of Leon's, it told you something more about, like, each story had to deal with this new kind of virus. I forget what they called it in this, what, the C-Virus? And, um... It, you know, each story, each campaign should tell you just their dealings with the viral outbreak of this C-Virus. You know what I'm saying? Rather than just trying to mix and mash everything together. Because I heard that some people are playing this. In order to make the story fit, they're playing the, the different campaigns in different orders. You know what I'm saying? And you shouldn't have to do that. You shouldn't have to play Chris's, you know, the first two missions of Chris's mission, and then go back and play Leon's, and then, you know, and then go back and play Jake's. You shouldn't have to go, you know, you shouldn't go out to do none of that. It, it should just flow, you know, like it's well written. And I don't know why they decided to do that. I mean, like to me, hold on. Yeah, you gonna defend for yourself while I reload, man. Damn, they do not like his ass. Damn. Like, get over here, bitch. <laughs> you pulled a scorpion on that ass. How you doing? Oh, shit. You just had to turn, didn't you? Damn, y'all. Yeah. But, um, you know, it just feels weird in how they did it. I don't know why they made that design decision. And for this game to be, because this is, you know, it's, it's, it's fucking Resident Evil. I mean, the only other game that was on par with Resident Evil in survival horror genre, and I mean, many of you younger guys might not know this, but it was fucking um, Parasite Eve on PlayStation. And I think that was also made, I think that was made by Square Enix, though. That was like their Resident Evil. And that game was badass. They put the same amount of quality into making that that they did, that Capcom did Resident Evil. And, um, and it showed. I mean... I don't know why Capcom decided to do it this way. It just seems weird for them to take. I mean, this is like the, like one of their baby franchises, you know. This is like Activision's Call of Duty or, you know, Microsoft's Halo. One of those. Fr oh, it's one of those hard guys. Yeah, fuck him. But it's one of those like you know, it's it's one of those games that you don't fuck with because it's like been lasting for what? What going on? What like almost 14, 15 years since Resident Evil came out? I mean. People expect it to be a certain way, and okay. the, the three different stories was fine. It was just, I don't know why they decided to mix and match the story like that. They could have made it three separate stories, and I, I don't know. It's just, it just feels awkward. Because, like, right now, as far as my story goes, it's like, okay, um, I was this guy, Pierce, had to find Chris 
to somehow track the B, you know, to join the BSAA, which really made no sense. Because if you're a government organization, why would you need one man? It ain't like he knew anything that they didn't. Especially if he, if he forgot everything. Man, what was y'all going to? Come on now. So it just seemed. Oh shit! Ran out of ammo. Yep, splash damage, bitch. Yeah, you ain't sneaking up on me, bitch. I don't need it for him. I don't want to waste all my damn ammo. Alright, yep. I'm out. I don't got to deal with his ass. I mean, it's, it's just... For them to suddenly do that. I mean, part five. A lot of people didn't like it. I played all the way through part five playing Carb with my brother. And I think part five kind of got away from where it made Resident Evil Resident Evil. But if that's where they wanted to take the franchise, then hey, you know. I mean, I'm all for it. I mean, it was a fun game. It was enjoyable. Ah, shit. Yes, blow up now while I'm not in the cutscene. Ah, oh, fuck you, game. I thought it was going to make me like, you know. You know, like sometimes you, you could be invincible while you're in the animations. <laughs> Am I supposed to wait for Chris or some shit? Um, Cause... I see they chasing his ass. Maybe he got to go on the other side and press a button or some shit. I wish I could turn the camera over and look, but right now it's just... I'm just sitting here. Damn. Will you get your ass over here? Doing some American Gladiators bullshit. <laughs> I hear people to my right. You better hurry your ass up, Chris. They hit me, I'm fucked. But I can't move. <sighs> Game just got me fucked up just now. Oh shit! Fuck! Fuck! Get up! Get up! Get up! Fuck! Fuck out my way! Right, let me reload this the way I need it. Whoa! Oh yeah! Yeah, go up this ass. Let's see. Do I have any um? No, I don't want to get rid of that. I got some first aid spray, don't I? Yeah, let me use that. Spray myself, you know, down with some smell goods. Okay, so where do I go now? But I still gotta activate that damn missile. Oh, yeah, that's right, I had to blow up into blast doors or some shit. Um, yo, Chris, handle that, man. Ah, oh, damn, you suck. Ah, uh, why not? I'll save some of my shotgun rounds. Alright, uh, let me not waste any more ammo on him. Oops, sucks to be you. Let's try to turn around. Alright, you gonna drop something? Oh, there you go. One thing I do like about this game now is the scope of the game and the set pieces and how the different each 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 of the different boards looked and how um I mean, how they tried to kind of make a bigger scope of the game. Because all the other games, it's like, oh, it's this one town or this one country that's fucked up. Whereas now, it's more like the world is dealing with this viral outbreak and shit rather than just one one isolated location. And I like that. It kind of raises the stakes a little bit. HQ to Alpha. Fighting in the city has spread. You need to apprehend Ada Wong now. Copy that. Tell our boys to hang in there. Like, they could really make, like, a separate game 
you know, I don't know what they would call it, but make it just about the BSAA. Dealing with new people and just dealing with a completely separate situation as far as, like, how to deal with these viral outbreaks and stuff. And then they could kind of take in, like, the team from Raccoon City. You know, like, um, you know, like, Operation Raccoon City. Bring them back and have them be, be in the game as well. You know what I'm saying? I think that would be pretty good. Wait, do I got the assault rifle? Let me know what's the shotgun shell for that. Yeah, let him deal with that. He got that. I ain't wasting no more ammo on them. Guessing I'm supposed to get to that plane. Is that why the plane lowered? Let me see if I can work my way left on the left side. Keep him busy for a little bit. We ain't get around here. I don't get my ass blown off. Shit. All right, you drop that guy to my right? No. All right, I ain't dealing with that. Come on, Pierce, get up. Oh fuck, they're in the damn plane. Oh shit, I thought that was the guy street down. Fuck that. I don't got time to deal with those Vulcan cannons right there. Fuck that. I thought that was the guy who had a light machine gun. And I was like, wait a minute, the guy moved. Why is he still shooting at me? That was a damn plane. I just didn't even see that shit. Look at that standing in front of that shit like, you know, I'm Superman and shit. Like I can just eat that shit. Uh, I guess I gotta shoot out the cockpit maybe. Um, 